And the Wake Up Morning Show rolling right along today. And we have a special guest in the studio with us. Let's say good morning to Jordan Rayner. How are you? Good morning. It's good to be here. Glad to have you back in Texas oh, for a little while anyway. Good to be back, man. Folks, you recognize her because uh, she is right now on season 24 of The Voice. Yeah, baby. Team Reba. Hashtag Team Reba. Hey, there it All is. Right. Well, congratulations uh, for for making it on the national television. That's got to be exciting for you. Oh, listen, I I didn't expect, you know, all of this. You know, I kind of auditioned as a, hey, we'll see what happens. And, uh, man, it's been a wild ride. Man, uh, uh, during your blind audition, you you came out and did Fancy. I sure did. And it's, uh, uh, and watching these, these, uh, these, these shows like this, they always say, "Oh, the hardest thing you ought to do, or the hardest thing you ought to never do, is sing one of the judges' songs in front of them." <laughs> it, did, did you know at the time that Reba was going to be a coach? When I you... did not. I picked the song before they announced that Reba was going to be a coach, and whenever I found out, I was like, "Uh oh!" <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Oh man, what have I got myself into?" But I stuck with it, and I kind of chose to look at it like, "Hey, this is fate." You know, it's like we're just meant to cross paths at this mm-hmm. particular time, and I'm going to stick with it. And it could have gone really bad or really good, and it went really good. It went really good. That was <laughs> it sure a- did. Four chair turn, baby. Yeah, they all spun around uh, and uh, made us dizzy watching it. They did. But uh, And then you came back in the uh, in the battle round there, and uh, you and Jackson just yeah. killed The Heart Won't Lie. Oh, thank you so much. I think it's going viral. That on, It sure online. is. It, it just- sure is. We worked so hard on it. I mean, we got the song, and it was new to both of us, mm-hmm. you know, because, I mean, I know a lot of Reba's catalog, but that song I had never heard. And so I really had to find a place in my voice for that song. I had to find a place in my body for that song. Because, first of all, it's a ballad, and it's a love song. So y- if you know me at all, I'm kind of a spire, you know, fire-spitting kind of kick-ass artist. And so to sing something this tender was really difficult. But we pulled it off, I think, and Reba was very pleased with it, and we're moving on. All right, very good. Folks, you can see her on The Voice. You can root for her as uh, she continues on, uh, hopefully to win that hundred grand. Yeah. Yeah, hundred grand and a record deal. Can't beat that. Fantastic. That'd be a pretty good Christmas present, I think. I think so. <laughs> Jordan <laughs> Rayner visiting the uh, Wake Up Morning Show this morning. We know you got to get back on the road here, but we do appreciate you stopping by, and we wish you the best of oh, luck on The Voice. Thank you so much. Thank you. Welcome back to the Back Roads tonight, brought to you by our good friends at Bill Fig Four. That was Damn Sandwich with Jordan Rayner, who is in the studio with us this Ooh. evening. How are you doing, Jordan? Oh, man, couldn't be better. How are you? <laughs> you got the spirit of Loretta Lynn on you, girl. Oh, man, I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> Thank you. She's one of my heroes. Oh, wow. Hey, uh, a lot of our uh, listeners, a lot of people just across the, the America have been watching you on season 24 of The Voice. Yes, What's that sir. been like? Oh, you know, it's just a little startup show. You know, I'm hoping it gets its footing <laughs> one of these days. But yeah. uh, no, it's been an incredible experience. I'll tell you, it's been, in a way, one of the hardest things I've ever had to do. You know, I've been in this business uh-huh. 10 years. I don't get really nervous. I'm not scared of much, but this has been a whole new challenge and I'm loving every second of it. You bet. You bet. T- tell us uh, for some of the listeners who, who, who may not be acquainted with you yet. Uh, d- tell us a little bit how you got started in this. Well, you know, f- I come from a musical family, right? And so I knew early on as a kid, you know, I used to cry over my math homework. You know, my mom would sit with mm. me at the kitchen table Preach. and I would just cry and cry and cry because you know school and books and all that just wasn't where i was gonna Mm -hmm. shine but you know when i got done with my homework i would run to my bedroom and play a guitar and you know or a piano and i would write songs and that's where my heart was and so i knew like that was i better get really good at that or i'm not gonna have much of a life you know so i got really good at that and i moved to nashville eight years ago been writing songs been doing the grind been doing the artist thing and doing it all on my own dime just working my butt off playing small gigs and putting little bits of money and pieces you know aside so that i can record music and put it out and you know here we are now season 24 of the voice and people are finally realizing that i'm on the planet and they're loving my music and it's amazing <laughs> well the backroads listeners are, are are familiar with you because we roll you regularly here oh thank you so much uh, 
All right, so coming up here in just a few moments, we're going to play your new song called Straight Shot. Tell us about that song. Oh, man, Straight Shot is a song that tells you everything you need to know about me. It says that I tell it like it is, and I shoot to kill, man. If if there's anybody that's ever met me, they know that I don't pull punches and I don't hold back. And so for any of my folks that their mouth tends to get them in trouble, this is your song. <laughs> All right, well, we got Straight Shot coming up here in just a few moments. Uh Texas Music and Radio Awards New Female Vocalist Ooh, of the Year. Yeah. How about that? Heck yeah, man. I like coming home and bringing some hardware home. That's right. Thinking right. about doing it again next year. Yeah? Okay, yeah. well, we hope so. Yes, sir. And with the voice, we hope you're bringing home a check as well. Oh, you better believe it. I don't enter nothing to lose. <laughs> we're talking this evening with Jordan Rayner, and we're going to roll right into her brand new song now. This is called Straight Shot on the Backroads. Yeah, buddy.